Bun Ziwashi Bunvenit, YouTube. This is Fan of Gaming, and I've got some more Space Pirates and Zombies for you today. Now, unfortunately, I did record some footage on Thursday, I believe, but I forgot to record my audio, so it was just gameplay footage. I will explain exactly what you missed, and then I will take the entire gameplay footage I have, speed it up to about a tenth of a second, and put it on the screen, uh, and we all should be caught up after that. So, here you will see that I got the shield boosters modules for my ships, and I believe I have one on all of my ships. Yes, I do. Uh, you might also notice that I have 416 res instead of the 1500 that I used to have, and I also have no goons left. I am out of goons. <clears throat> uh, I had a very large battle that I probably should have waited a while to have, but I got cocky and I did it, so what can you do? Uh, anyway, also, I am in Seoul right now. I destroyed this UTA station. I don't know why. It was. It gave me pretty much absolutely no reward whatsoever. Uh, let's go visit it and see if, see if it's still there. It, it might be, actually. Oh god, they respawn? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. They totally do respawn. Okay, no, we're not doing this again. Nope, sorry, we're getting out of here. It's a really weak station anyway, it's not really worth killing. Uh, when you attack it, a few other ships pop up, though. Even though there aren't any in the system right now. <clears throat> okay, uh, I also went through quite a few warp gates, I believe. You'll see I have unlocked up to this area here. They seem to have a thruster engine, which I want. But I went there, and I didn't have enough res. Because I'm horrible at this game. Let's see. These guys don't have anything good. I might go here. Who's that? Scatter cannon. I definitely want that. We need level 4 in cannons. Eh, I'll presume it's worth it. Supercharges the magazine. Okay, well anyway. So, I will now... Um, take my gameplay footage and speed it up to about a quarter of a second. So, okay, we shall now be caught up. Good. Uh, let's... For now, let's just go to the system here. Wait, what's over here, I wonder? Oh, that's crap. Uh, we'll go this way first. We might as well get that easy res. And who knows, in the next system, maybe there's some good tech that we can unlock. Alright. I, I feel really bad, also, because I was, like, demoralized after I realized that I did not record my gameplay, my, uh, excuse me, my audio. And so Friday, I did not record anything. I just wanted to take a break. And I was like, okay, you know, Saturday, I will definitely record stuff. And then I realized that I cannot record on the weekends. Don't ask me why, I just can't. It's horrible time. What is this? Oh, yeah. Nah. We could get that, couldn't we? They don't like us too much, though. Short range missile launcher. A volley of independently controlled warheads? I kind of want that, honestly. I think we're going to go try to dock with them, even though they're hostile towards us. I'll... I'll... I'll, eh. I'll have to tell my smaller ships to stay away. There we go. While I dock on my own. Oh, run away, smaller ships. I read that you can dock with hostile stations, so let's find out. Oh my gosh, you can! That is awesome. Oh, they won't sell us stuff, though. That's a shame. Uh, that station is so much stronger than the other one, so I do not want to try to fight them. We'll find SRM launchers later. Or maybe I'll come back another time and improve our relationships with the civilians in here. Relations, I mean. Pardon me. Alright, we are out of the system. Not the system, but the area. <clears throat> Gosh, we are so low on goons. It is ridiculous. I lowered my turtle head's goon count, so even if they die, it won't be a huge hit. I think they only hold five now. Yeah, five each. But still, we do not have any reserve goons whatsoever. Um, so we're in pretty bad shape. 
pretty much everyone in this system hates us, so let's not tarry here. Let's just go to the blockade. With luck, I'll be able to destroy it without any trouble. As always, I'm going to start out with a tug. It's the biggest threat to me right now. These other ships aren't too good against our shields anyway. And the tug is just... Again, it's so tough compared to the rest of them. Man, I've definitely changed my tune about the missiles. Especially higher tech ones, from what I understand, they get a lot stronger. Like, exponentially growing stronger with each tech level, almost. Not really, but still. Oh, I love how the missiles just change direction immediately if your target gets destroyed. It's really handy. Alright. Now, of course, we're gonna go get all these goons, because we definitely need them. Oh man, I had to space both of them. Okay, let's see. I was pressing backspace instead of space to get the uh, tactics menu. There should be some goons and tech up here. Might as well get some res along the way, too. Right. Yep, res, res, res. Alright, space one of them. Space another guy, and another, and we got one. That sucks. Okay. I normally wouldn't go out of my way like this, but we seriously need these goons. We're in huge trouble if we don't get a bunch of them soon. Alright, looks like we got one or two more. And there we go. There's one over here, but we won't bother. Alright. Let's go to this station. I mean, system. We haven't been here yet. Now let's see how many goons we got. We have seven goons surplus now. That's awesome. Not really. In fact, it's quite not awesome. Did the ship just launch a photon torpedo or something this way? I guess not. Must be going crazy. Ah, uh, let's see. Do we have any research points? No, we do not. We are tech level 14, though. That is cool. Um, they're neutral to us. We could go buy that stupid photon torpedo. I guess we might as well. It's not a photon torpedo, but you know what I mean. Oh, gosh. Explosive barrels. I hate those things. That's a pretty high speed limit, don't you think? I think so. Look at all those little drones. I would not want to fight them. Uh, 76 res. Yeah, why not? I'll take that. I might as well see how much worse they are than our lasers. Let's see. It uses more power. It does more damage. It's wor worth noting. It's got the same range and firing speed, but it has less accuracy. It's good versus armor, weak versus shields. That's just not going to do. That's totally useless for what we want right now. Shame. Might have been a decent weapon. Now what I could do is I could give each of my turtle heads one of each. That could work. But, I don't know. That just doesn't seem to do it for me. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I uh, probably should have mentioned this earlier, but... I think we unlocked a new ship last time. And by last time, I mean the 0.25 seconds of gameplay footage you saw that I had recorded last time. So, let's see. Um, yes, we've got the Gull. I think we already had the Array. And I think we already had the Gimp. But the Gull, I discovered, is absolute crap. It is so horrible. It is not even worth getting. That's what cost me most of my res. I lost the same ship three or four times in a fight. I would have only lost this hug once or twice. Uh, okay, looks like they got a tug, as always. This is a pretty it's a standard tug. It's not too tough, not too weak. Let's get that shield down. There we go. 
I love when they're neutral towards you. You can get their shields down before they even start attacking you. Of course, now my shields are down. But the tug is almost dead, and uh, so am I, interestingly enough. So let's run away. Damn it! Okay, okay. I need to start getting a new plan. Oh man, I had I did not have enough goons for that. This is not okay. <sighs> Dang it, man. I'm not too happy about this. And we just lost on the ship. Well, if we can get our tug, we should be able to fight the rest of these guys off pretty easily. Start reconstructing the other ships, too. Okay, got one. Oh, I just love the tug so much. These smaller ships just don't stand a chance. Well, that ship has no armor in the rear. That is just so weird. Why would it not have armor on the rear? Like, when it needs to run away, it's just screwed. Alright, well, we, we, can, we can gather some of these goons. A good few of them came from our own ships. So let's get them. Look, see these guys? This guy has one goon, now five. This guy has one. It's just pitiful. We have nothing now. Ah, oh, man, it's going to be tough to get by over the next few systems, I think. Oh, the, da the data just disappeared. By the way, I think I discovered that when you destroy a space station, I think it drops any tech that it might have had. But I'm not sure at all on that, so don't quote me on it. That's just my observation of what seems to be the case. Oh no, these guys are destroying the, uh, the whatchamacallums. The goons. No, I need the goons. Especially these, since these came from our own destroyed ships. Oh. Maybe these guys aren't destroying them, maybe they're just spontaneously decompressing in the horrible vacuum that is space. Eh, I don't know. Damn it! Okay, yeah, we lost most of the goons because we're too slow. But that's okay. We've got enough to fill our current ships up, I think. What's this system have? Oh my goodness, is that a crew cannon? It is indeed a suicide cannon. Oh my goodness. Quick and highly effective way to deploy marines onto an enemy ship. Wow. Shells that miss their target will breach after a short time allowing rescue. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Well, alright. Damages and disable systems. That's interesting. Um, I might actually consider using that at some point, but right now I don't think so.